Hi there, I'm Shane from Procom Enterprises and today I'm going to show you how to uh, check and maybe correct your time settings on a Uniview NVR. Uh, time is very important, especially when you're searching. If you don't have time correct on not only the NVR but also all of your cameras, you might find searching for a certain event to be rather difficult. So I'm going to help you do that. I'm going to right click and click menu. I've already logged in so you don't have to, I, I have not done that, but um, you'll want to use the administrator account to accomplish this. Uh, different Uniview models are going to have slightly different uh, interfaces, but they are all going to have the same basic um, uh, settings and options to play with. So we're going to click on System here, and then we're going to click on Time. Uh, check your time zone first. This is where we live. Um, this is the date format that I'm using, month, day, year and the 24-hour time format, which prevents any uh, AM and PM confusion. Now, the system time is correct. Uh, I could change it if I want to, but I don't because I have an NTP server enabled. NTP is Network Time Protocol, and what that means is uh, there is a just a little server spitting out the uh, time information that any device on the network can update from. So here, I have a PC at this IP address that is chugging out uh, time information at regular intervals and updating anything that is set to be looking for time from that IP address. Now the reason I've done that is on Uniview, at least at this time, you can't simply put in a domain and uh, acquire time information. So for instance, uh, we like to use the Oklahoma State um, time server that's just out there on the internet, which is great, but I don't have an IP address for them. So I have downloaded and installed a network time uh, server on my PC. It was free, easy to set up. And now my NVR is getting the time information from there. Um, what's also good is that by default, any other Uniview cameras that are set up with this NVR are automatically going to be getting their time from this NVR. So if you have the NVR correct, the other Uniview cameras are going to be correct. The only caveat to that is any third-party cameras that are connected to the NVR are probably not set up that way, so you'll want to set their time accordingly. So we know this is correct. I'm going to also check our daylight savings time, which is enabled, and you want to make sure that you have it set to a certain uh, couple of weeks, uh, the second week of March and the first week of November reason for that is if you were to set it up with just a specific date, which a lot of NVRs allow, but I don't think Uniview does, at least this one doesn't, uh, it would update for those dates, but then next year, that's not going to happen. So setting it up for a certain week is going to have that time update at, on a Saturday of the second, uh, in the second week of March at 2 a.m. every single year. So that's what we want. Uh, if I have made any changes, I would hit apply. Now I'm just going to hit back. And here we are back to the beginning. 